What's up guys, X Garage 101 here. Just got back from London. And uh it wasn't too much a very of a very good day. Um first of all we went to see Dave today to see what he was up to. And uh, as soon as we got there, Dave is just a total asshole. He started bringing up stuff from my past, um, which I'll get to in a minute. He was complaining that I don't do anything for myself, that I don't do anything. Well, who the hell does this Dave Rock think he is? You know? He's complaining to me because I went to the farm this uh, past weekend, right? And uh, he's like, all, all you want to do is come by and, and use my vehicles. Well, what else is there to do at the farm than, other than drive the fucking cars? I paid him for the gas I used, but he's still bitches. You know? Uh, I got these tattoo duns la last week. And he's bitching about that, saying it was the stupidest thing. Well, it's my fucking choice. And by the way, th these are from uh, the movie uh, Devil's Reject. He says, yeah, and back to Dave. He was saying, this is the stupidest thing, and I have some loose screws or whatever. No, I think, Dave, you had the, lo the loose screws in your fucking head because of your fucking pass. Yeah, I'm going out and I'm fucking saying it to you right now. I don't give a shit anymore. I'm done with the farm. I want nothing to do with it. With it. So, so on that subject, I'm done talking about Dave. He was, I'm just so aggravated. Unbelievable how I'm aggravated. Every time, every time he sees me or every time I talk to him, he always brings up my past. Yeah, a couple years ago, I may have been into some bad stuff. I partied. And been some into some stuff. I'm coming up out and telling you guys right now. All right, me, I lived the party life. I needed stuff to keep me up all night. I was into some pretty bad stuff, but I've been clean now for over eight months. All right, over eight months I've been clean. And haven't touched anything, other than James Reddy, of course, and some alcohol, which that's awesome. <laughs> but yeah, but for somebody that's stop doing it like cold turkey for eight months you don't go mention it every time that you're going to see him or if you're talking to him every fucking time he does this and then going back about the stuff he says about Rickham that's total bullshit alright total fucking bullshit so goes out to Dave Rock fuck you and fuck you and fuck you